<laughs> Next up, they're uh, one of my favorite duets. They are the Bay Area's boundary pushing burlesque troupe. The most offensive act to ever perform at my show, To Rest Without Regrets. They are recently booed and banned off the stage off their latest tour in Portland. Tonight, true. Very true. <laughs> Tonight, they would like to do something different. And they would like to explore the emo side of Freddy Krueger. Please, put your fists up for Freddy if y'all are Freddy fans. Coming to the stage with a premiere for you tonight, the one and only, the duet of danger, Prisoners of Love. structure of your womanhood bursts every drop of blood. I'm talking buckets of blood, rivers of blood, and when there is not enough blood, we will raid a local farmhouse, slaughter their prize hoggers, and pour a swine bath for you to fall asleep in what could be more sensual. This is not your welcome to prime time, bitch. This is your welcome to the wet dream of the dream stalker, because even dead vengeful spirits have sex fantasies, and there ain't nothing that gets me going like a virgin prom queen covered in pig's blood. And believe me, kids, when you haunt dreams, you've seen every fucking fantasy there is to see. Let me remind you, I haunt the dreams of high school-aged boys, right? <laughs> Do you know how difficult it is these days to pull the pot martini away from the open mock clint of the enacting rape fantasy long enough to be able to look at your face and actually fucking scream before you slit their throat? Killing just ain't what it used to be before the internet. <laughs> without these few vessel turd stains replaying the last scene that they just saw before sleep. If you were stuck slaughtering during Red Tomb Huge's Pornhub Fantasies play on repeat, then you'd understand why nothing gets my little Freddy Krueger going like a fucking underage telekinetic prom queen covered in motherfucking pig's blood. <laughs> Dear Carrie, And when I say red, I mean red, like blood. We're both so good at killing tonight, Carrie. Let's kill each other. Ooh! Carrie, let it flow like your first period hitting during shower time. And my body, my mouth will be your prey. Carrie, I don't want to know where your white Hershey kiss tits end and where the pig's blood begins. And there is no shame. In needing the things and what monsters mean to get off nothing erects the elm in my street like a homicidal, yeah! like a homicidal telekinetic motherfucking virgin prom queen covered in motherfucking pig's blood. that when I visit you in your dreams you will yowl until my glove grows a fifth claw that's a little bit pinker and a little bit chodier that's my fucking penis, right? Let's have a mighty wet with swine blood t-shirt contest I promise you will be the winner, baby your prize will be the tears of our victims In the distance, I can hear you crunching the bones of every underage child and my blades penetrated. Oh, that one was... Oh. Oh. Carrie, I hear your telekinetic mind connected to the 
mind to? Would you mind when you're not busy being baptized? She's a hot bitch, right? I mean, fuck! Maybe when you're not busy taking your fanny off. Or being covered in pig's blood. <laughs> Jumping into the bones of our enemies. Oh! Would you mind giving this vengeful spirit not a fucking hand job, bitch? Give me a mind job. Because nothing puts the spring in my wood slasher like watching a nude, underage, telekinetic, homicidal Virginia prom queen covered in fucking pig blood. Okay, maybe we are a bit desensitized since the internet came around. It's possible. <laughs> or maybe when everyone tells you that you're a monster, it takes another homicidal monster to convince you that you are worthy of love. Maybe, maybe Carrie, only you can translate my threats into Shakespearean songs. Or more likely, I just want to feel the blood seeping through the back of your wrists to know what it's like to spoon a bitch like a crucifix. 